about it. Okay, okay. Uh, Abigail, it was amazing. Start from the beginning. So he picked me up at 6.03. When he came to the door, he said, sorry, I'm late. He wasn't even really late. It was 6.03. Anyway, then he told me I looked nice and we got in his car. <gasps> Abigail, he held the door open for me. So then he took me to Roman's and we shared a supreme pizza. We both picked the olives off because neither of us like olives. What did you guys talk about? Everything. Abby, he is so easy to talk to. He told me about his childhood, asked me about mine. We talked about graduation and fears of the future. He's planning to move to Utah. I told him you love Utah. <laughs> yeah, I do. I told him I didn't have any plans for after college yet, and he actually made a comment about me moving with him to Salt Lake. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, but it was probably just a joke. <laughs> I said he should take you instead because you're good at skiing and all that other stuff that he likes. That would be fun. Anyway, anyway, I thought he was going to take me back to my house, but we ended up going to the square and walking around for a little bit. And you know that building on the corner that we always say we want to go to the top of? Yeah. Well, he took me up there. At first we were just looking over the city. And then he told me he had one more surprise for me. So we went back to his car, and he opened the trunk, and inside he had this bag, and it had a ton of fruit in it. What? <laughs> yeah, he had a baseball bat, and we played baseball with the fruit on the roof of that building. That sounds so fun. It was literally like a movie. I'm still smiling just thinking about all of it. Oh, I haven't told you the best part. What? So he took me home, and we were walking back to my front porch, and I was about to go inside, but he grabbed my hand. Yeah? And he told me that he had a really good time, and then he asked if he could kiss me. What did you say? I said, yes. And he leaned in, and Abigail, it was the best kiss ever. You there? What? Yeah, sorry, I'm here. Did you hear what I said? No, sorry, you cut out, I think. I said I really like him, Abby. I think this could go somewhere. Thank you for introducing us. Yeah, yeah, of course. I'm really happy for you. <laughs>